Hi, my name is Ryan Hornberg, and I have the privilege of being the director for the upcoming FC Lacrosse National Camp at Lancaster Bible College. We are so excited to have your son or daughter involved with this camp and know that it's going to be an incredible week together, not only developing our lacrosse skills on the field, but also pursuing God off the field. With a little over two weeks away, we start to get a lot of questions on specific things. Great questions, but ones that ultimately are gonna help you guys have better experience. So we wanted to take some time and go through the top 10 questions that we get as we are a little over two weeks away from camp. Number one is camp registration. By now you have already registered your son or daughter for camp. Now all you have to do is come and show up between two and 4 p.m. And when you come, you'll see clearly marked signs that direct you to the Horst Athletic Center. There, you'll be able to walk the registration, get your key, get your bag, and someone will escort you to the appropriate dorm room. Number two, camp payments. If you've already registered your son or daughter for camp, you are good to go on camp payments. If you selected one of our payment plans, we will automatically charge the credit card you put on file the day before camp so that there are no balances. Number three, health forms. If you have registered for camp, you are all good to go. If you registered, you completed every single health form and all the information we need online. Number four, COVID safety and guidelines. We are pleased to announce that at Lancaster Bible College, there are no restrictions currently in place as they follow the Pennsylvania State and CDC guidelines. Now, with that being said, we will still be operating in a safe manner. We have worked with our nurses and athletic trainers to have COVID safety measures in place in case we do see symptoms, and when inside, we'll be doing appropriate distance and staying together with our huddles. Number five, roommate request. If you put down a roommate request when you registered, we have done our best to accommodate that. In most situations, we can, but sometimes Billy's a really popular guy and has five people all wanting to be with him. In that case, we'll make sure that they're at least on the same floor and in the same huddle together so they can still have a great experience together as a group. Number six, dorm rooms. All of the dorms at Lancaster Bible College are air conditioned, but just as a reminder, you still need to bring your own bedding, either sheets or a sleeping bag or whatever you're comfortable with when you sleep. And also don't forget your toiletries. Number seven, food or dietary restrictions. Are you gluten-free, vegan, or have food allergies? We got you covered and we will be working closely with the LBC dining facility to accommodate every need. If your camper does have any dietary restrictions, please just let us know. Number eight, FC Lacrosse merchandise. We will have merchandise available for sale during the time of registration and at our camp store. Every evening, the camp store will be open for merchandise and also for snacks, food, and other important camp items. Number nine, shuttle transportation. For those who are traveling by airplane, we do have a shuttle service from BWI Airport. The cost is $75, and you must let Camp Director Ryan Hornberg know if you're willing and wanting to participate in this service. Number 10, can I send mail to my son or daughter while at camp? Yes, you definitely can send mail. I know they like that letter from mom and dad or maybe some, some cookies or some snacks. You can send it to the following address. FCA Lacrosse Camp, Lancaster Bible College, 901 Eden Road, Lancaster, Pennsylvania, 17601. Hopefully that answers most of your guys' questions. But if not, feel free to reach out to us. You can email me directly at rharanberg, that's R H O R. A-N-B-U-R-G at FCA.org or give us a call at our office at 443-212-8131 anytime and we'll get those answered for you.